You know that Zephyr's coming over again, and Cuckoo. I almost want to say he's looking to make a jump, but he doesn't have RP. A little bit difficult for him to make the jump. Oh, he does blink in, but he blinks into the Aether Emin, and now he's going to skew himself back. They've got the summary. The blink. Oh, it's on the floor. They've got everybody. Supernova right on top of it. They're going to oh kill the Zephyr, Cuckoo, God. and Carl. They've got the Fiend's Grip on the 23. What a maneuver from Team Spirit. Oh, collapse. You can't just sit back and play chicken for eight minutes. So they will see if they can find an invasive move into the enemy triangle. The Poshka oh, is the frontliner front here. Good. Smoke is popped. Oh, he must just okay. straight in. Oh, jumps in. He's getting decimated, but there's a save from Ollie for now. But no, there's too much damage to withstand. He does not have buyback. Oh, the JP spear. is next on the list. Double kill for Yotaro. As it looks like Flyfly with the BKB will get out of dodge, but a triple kill now for the Morphling. And nice arena from Collapse. They find Flyfly. This will be an enormous kill. He turns into Monkey King for just a moment. Ultra kill Yotaro. What a turnaround from Team Spirit. And make it a rampage. Yotaro, beast mode enabled. And uh, they, they did rather quickly. And that might be all OG needs. Again, he's sitting on an OBS and Sentry and Avers to mail. Wait, Portos again! They got two mail! They don't have Chrono afterwards, but they might not need it. Mira continuing to control, looking for another round of this. Now, RP gonna get off the mark oh, and collapse! Portos are back in! What in the hell? Sumail has a Ghost Scepter now inside the Fountain! I don't know if he bought that or not, but figure of death out! Usually when OG is in the Fountain, it's good! Not this time! As they pull him back down again! No tail dies! Yeah, you have a way to just like check the pit for free. <laughs> Other than just like sending in Toronto Tokyo and hoping he doesn't get vacuumed or something. It's true. Portos, oh. they got him caught. Oh, and it's Hopton. They pulled him in too. Oh, no. Not like that. OG now looking for more. Seb got to run away. They buy back on tops and wall down. Yadaro, vacuum, chase. Sumail thought about the rundown, but with the two buybacks, Team Spirit will retreat. And with that, Roche will also spawn. They're gonna smoke up here too. Of course, they still have everything. That you know, these are the cheap picks that you get with Horn Toss. Still holding Chrono, still holding RP. And that combo of like the Horn Toss with the Lion, and <laughs> oh. they get him again. Pull him back in. Bring him on down. Hook shot. Try to salvage it. It's not gonna be enough. OG don't have an answer for the mag. As Soxa also gets killed. Unbelievable composure and presence of mind coming they from this Team Spirit roster. Too, right? I mean, all that damage was magical. He took 382 physical Got damage. Got him again! Body. What? They find him another time, and the Chrono down! Collapse! The absolute madman! They're gonna take you to the heroes. Oh, I, I love that. Right on down the way. No tail is there, but they jump and find the back line. Able to catch onto Sumail. That's a pretty good target. Hex afterwards. Yadaro eating up this tiny as Sumail eventually falls. Oh, and they were so close to just running into no tail, too. That yeah. could have been so much better for OG if he was the one to fall, but grabbing oh. the king instead. He has fallen and now collapsed. Well, they might just find no oh, tail anyway. Even gonna drop the hard for him. Stage. This is from all the voice lines God and the sprays. Damn. Team Spirit putting on a performance here. Showing everything. And he find him again. Collapse and runs into your, your screen. Seb. What? Just like that. They find themselves. Seb try and give him a high five. And find the kill again. I think he was changing his chat wheel binds. He got caught in the trees. <laughs> much away from Spirit. And you can see Spirit, in fact, continue with the smoke. Even though Roshan is taken, they still feel strong. Yep. They've yep. got these BKBs. Exactly. They have their timing here. They want to force a fight. They're going to get the opening. Kaka jumps in with the center on it. Tokyo's going to just go straight towards JT. In with the BKBs down under the time. Ollie gets taken out. JT to fall as well. There'll be a buyback from Ollie. Blindfly's going to be the new focus in collapse. Spears him back. Collapse still has the arena to play with if he needs to. Fly Missing the start, Arena's out, they've caught the ball, Collapse, locks them in, the heels from Mira, keeping Collapse alive, the triple kill for Yotaro, ultra kill for Yotaro, Emo, the last man left standing here for IG, as he hides in the trees, Toronto Tokyo looking to see if he can get the catch, quick just eliminate down, up the tree line in fact, oh, over the power shot, we'll see him, remember the remnant, the TP out, Emo, he, whoa, he's not going to make it away, they get him as well, First, onto the Lena, to at least salvage things somewhat there for Team Spirit. Toronto, Tokyo pushing out the top lane now. As we do have Shard online for Zai, so the Wolves. Mira gets stopped mid. Spawning. This could be a setup for Matsu. Okay. 
Thunderhide is available oh, there. Oh, the force staff from Matu, but he's Collapse gonna force so out his BKB. Good. Mira saving or getting cold embrace for now. Pops the shadow realm as well, but there's collapse with the initiation onto Matu, and now the Orchid on top of it. He's already used the BKB. Nice save from Puppy for the time being, but Matu's still stuck in a terrible spot right now. Has to just stand his ground, and there's the terrorize to follow. Big kill for Team Spirit. Looks like Zai is next on their list. And down he goes, Cinderin. Great execution from Team Spirit. Oh my god, I hope we get a replay of that. What an insane four step from Collapse there. Hard. Against Wyvern, Sven, and Meg to yeah. ever do I mean, it. Puppy has definitely survived through a lot of this, but Yotaro now has a nullifier. So you can dispel Eon Disc. And well, Puppy, he's gonna get the disruption off, gets stuck inside the Bramble, pops the Ghost Scepter preemptively, but he's gonna die shortly after. Great oh, curse! Yep, that's a huge curse onto three heroes as Team Secret get RP from Collapse, and the right clicks are there from Yotaro. Triple oh, kill for him, making it an ultra kill. Will he get another Rampage at TI-10? Absolutely, Yotaro does it again, Cinderin! Holy Jesus! Yataro and Cup. A really quick burst. You don't really want to take it right now for Team Spirit, but they forced out some rotations at the very least. They got to try and hold this tower, I think, or else this oh. really wasn't worth it. No IO save this time, though. That's the danger of the relocate. Nothing to say outside of Vision. They don't see him. Now they do. The pullback going to be able to get that Steward. The <laughs> Vision not quick enough, and nothing to say goes down. Now looking for more. Ame has to be careful. Zinq you there as well. Oh, Ooh, but Ame nice. with the waveform through it. Brilliant play. And, and on this afterwards. Now the chase looking for more. Can they control? Do they have enough for the kill? The Terrorize comes out, but he got the strength form off. Faith Beyond jumps away. The Steward back. One to two. And the RP. Oh, Collapse did it to him again. And look, they're just surrounding him. There's no chance to help. They have, oh. the, they have the Shaker, but there is nothing else left in the tank there for Ame. Although, trying to TP out, but the stun comes through right at the end. And LGD, another triple kill for Yatoro. You can see Team Spirit not comfortable just hitting away in the Roche Pit. Nothing to say walks in. Yadro up front and center. Jeez. Nothing to say. They jump in. There's the control. The damage out. Maposhka's dead. Buys back immediately. Yadro turns to fight. Destroys. Nothing to say. They've got him. Caught to the side. Ame in some trouble. Hitting from the low ground. How many misses are there? It doesn't matter. As they chase him down and kill him off. A great win for Team Spirit as they will find more and more. Unbelievable. Oh, the chase continues. Yaro just chases him down. And Echo afterwards trying to buy a little bit of space. Nothing to say, but can the kill collapse? Trying to take him down, but no, it won't happen. On the side, Toronto Tokyo will fall. But the big stun afterwards. Yaro moving in. He's big, he's bad, he's Luna trying to kill him off. The fear, the pullback, collapse, he's got him. CQ looking dead as well as they turn and hit. Another one bites the dust, but they buy back now. On Zinq, Faith Beyond getting absolutely shredded. Yadro is too big as they catch him in again. The pushback, they got him caught and gonna maybe find the kill. Nothing to say, down low, dead. Another huge win, Team Spirit. They won't be denied. The horse toss catches on the ZQ. Oh, and Yaro just slaughter. The way they play these fights, they're so in sync with one another. GG oh. is called. They call it a Cinderella story. Team Spirit, the retreat. Yeah. I think this is a very intelligent thing that LGD have recognized in this game. They've been dominated in Vision for two games straight, and they feel like, you know what, maybe they're better at boarding than me. How do I solve it? Or collapse. Well, Take care of the Vision. He's gonna get the grab on the Faith Beyond. The BKB's pop. He's gonna look down the RP, catches the two cores. Sunshine comes in. They kill off Faith Beyond. The Static Storm is on to our man. The Yatori's gonna look to bail out. Collapse as well. Go for the DB away. He gets out. They all get out on Spirit. You have to feel for him, man. This game is not easy. Like, there's just so many heroes that get on top of you and eliminate you in a second. Nine. Talking of which, Nine is experiencing that exactly as he gets just turned into a pig and absolutely slaughtered. That's bad. That's going to be a buyback, I would imagine. They now throw out the Astral onto the Medusa. Me Meanwhile, right Monkey in the back, in the back line's just going to pop down that Wukong's command from the tree line, giving them the vision, giving them the damage, and the Bane is going to fall as well. Oh my goodness, Collapse. Oh. He's just killing everybody. So much damage. The pumping out of this Outworld Devourer. This is ridiculous. Gatoro jumping in, looking for another. They'll bring down Snakey as well. The vision here. Spirit. Empire, lay down a ward, it's in vision. Dude, they're, they're so afraid. Vanscore, gonna get caught. Tornado, it's finally happening. Has that BKB. Arena, it's going to hold with 
the follow-up, though. So Kitaro jumps in, wants to blow him up. There's going to be the sun strike afterwards. Now Tokyo landing all this damage on top of him. Three are dead. Dude, what an arena from collapse. In the moment they needed it, he gave it to them. Now, the Yule's we'll having to lift up. Trying to interrupt this arrow coming through, but the stun is there. They find the kill. Four go and down, and there's the champ. Give it to him. As Team Spirit found that opening. Oh, Meanwhile, so Snake King's back up again now as well. Strike coming through on a Toronto Tokyo. Snake King's back up. Time walk into the pit. They see that Roche is at about half health. And they've been throwing the alacrity on a skitter, but they've caught it. They're looking for the RP. No, they've already got the feast group coming through on the face of Swing. There's the RP on the two with the Wukong's command around them. Skitter, Snaking, they both died. They've got the buyback available on Skitter. They gotta look over as the face of has gotta come back into the fight. They kill off nine. He's got buyback. Rose still Chrono up. Half health. They're not committing into it. They still have Chrono. And I believe they still have Cataclysm ready to go. So the Wombo combo is still available. Skitter time's off. Time walks into the pit. They've got the Bramble Maze down, and Skitter's just gonna go through Roach. Yutero looking. Skitter right click. Same. Mira shows himself. Curse Crown on a Skitter. They've got the Primal Spring right onto these heroes as Curse Crown stuns up too, but they've got the Hex on to Yatoro. They'll drop down the Chrono. Do they have the Cataclysm? Yes, it's gonna come down. The Nightmare and all the Nightmare saved from Maposhka. Maposhka saving Yatoro, but he's Yatoro still gonna survive. The Skewer back on a multiple heroes. They get the kill on Fata as well as nine. They'll take him too. They look over at Skitter and they will kill him off. 33. You can only just fight. It's a full team wipe for Team Spirit. They will dominate. I like it. Let's see what the, the Windbreaker. Right one K movement speed. Hasn't popped the phase yet. There's two K, two point three K. Woo! Jeez, he's gonna be passing uh, Captain Mar pretty soon, guys. I don't know. He might already be fast. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think he's actually surpassed the average Mar moves. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's just